what this means is that when you think about binary bit masks that you tend to get into with these types of uh, numbers, you can think of each digit, and by digit I do mean things that are alphanumeric, not just numeric, alphanumeric, so in this case the F and the C, but each digit is a representation of four bits. Four bits. Two to the first, second, third, and fourth. And therefore, without knowing these numbers at all, I can tell you that the shape of this hexadecimal number will have the topmost 12 bits that are of an identical shape. And simply because I know what the Fs are, those are going to be all ones, just be straight ones. Then all of the rest of the, I think they're called uh, nibbles, half a byte, four bits, each of those will then also have the same shape because they're all Cs. And this is one way that you can start to have mental mappings without ever knowing exactly what the binary representation is, but to understand the breakdown of the space when you see something that's in hex and you're mentally converting it to binary. This then can be really helpful for you to be able to sort of visualize and do like a mental interpretation of whether or not some sort of hexadecimal number has the right kind of mapping to a binary number.